Hi all students, uh, I'm Saili Kale. Uh, I've made this video to answer a query that we are seeing a lot these days, which is which lot is Maruti Sir in? And I know that there's a lot of anxiety behind that question, a lot of concern. People are worried and are afraid that it might affect their chances of getting in. So I'll answer the question that does one person, can it affect your chances of scoring well in CAT? Can it affect your percentile? Can it uh, affect an entire slot as such? So the answer to that is yes and no. So let me explain the no part first. So can one person affect the scaling in a particular slot? So let us first understand how scaling takes place. There are two parts to your scaling. One is the average score. Average is basically the uh, average score of the entire slot. That is 100,000 people. One person cannot affect the average score of 100,000 people. This is basically the total sum of all the scores divided by 1 lakh people. So here the toppers have no impact. There is another part to your scaling process, which is the 0.1 percentile score. The 0.1 percentile score is basically like fine tuning your scaling. The big push either upwards or downwards comes from the average score. Basically, this average score determines most of your scaling. The 0.1 percentile or the topper score does marginal impact on your scaling either upwards or downwards. It has basically, if you can consider, this is the big push, like the big iron hammer. And the small goldsmith hammer is basically the top 0.1 percentile uh, scaling either upwards or downwards. So even if you consider the top 0.1 percentile scaling, what exactly is this scaling and how does it affect you? So top 0.1 percentile scaling is the average score of the top 100 in a particular slot. 0.1 percentile of 100,000 students is 100. It's the average of 100 people. So one faculty cannot really change this top 0.1 percentile average also. And these are not average students. These are not ordinary students. These are the toppers of a particular slot. These are basically students who have done exceptionally well in their slot. Their scores are very close together and they're very close to the top. So one person will not really change this average also by much. And in general, most of the faculties are equally distributed across slots. There are a lot of rumors going about that, okay, one slot has a lot of repeaters, one slot has a lot of faculties. This, these rumors have no basis. This is not true at all. Most faculties are equally distributed across slots. So any one faculty will have no real impact on the scale score as such. I'd also like to remind all those students who feel that Maruti has a big impact on the scale score that while he has been a 100 percentile of four times, he has never really topped the exam. There have always been students who have done better than him. There have always been students who have scored better than him in each of the sections. So one person cannot really change the scaling of any one slot. This is just absolutely not true. So I'll come to the yes part. So the yes part is basically it has a psychological impact. I see a lot of anxiety already. I see a lot of people who are already feeling that they have no chance because somebody uh, is saying that this person is in this slot or this person is in that slot. Firstly, I'd like to tell you that we have disclosed it to no one in which slot we are. Nobody knows in which slot we are. So if they are saying that Marathi is in this slot or that slot, they don't really know the truth at all because we have not told anyone. Because we know that the only way that it can actually affect our students, it can negatively affect anybody is psychologically. Psychologically, you can feel that you don't have a chance. Psychologically, you can feel the anxiety and you can give up before you even really see your true potential being realized. So that's why we have never really told anybody. Now, I want you to realize what this fear is, what this anxiety is. See, this anxiety is basically coming from the fact that cat is very near and you feel that you have not prepared enough or you do not stand a chance. I want to tell you that hard work will pay off. All of these fears that you feel are phantom fears. They are not real fears. These fears are not real, but they can prevent you from really achieving your potential. You should essentially dismiss all of these fears and focus on what is important. I'll give you a story which often uh, inspires me to do well whenever I am faced with self-doubt or whenever I'm anxious. This story gives me a lot of hope and a lot of direction in life. So this story comes from my favorite part of Ramayan when uh, Hanumanji is trying to search for Sita Devi in Lanka. He initially searches her for her everywhere, but he's not able to find her. Finally, after searching for her everywhere, he feels like giving up. He feels that it is likely that Sita has already been killed. Then he goes into a negative spiral where he feels that if Sita is dead, I will have failed in my objective, in my mission. I will have to go back and tell uh, Ram and Lakshman that Sita Devi has not been found. And they will also die of grief. And if they die of grief, my King Sugriva will also die of grief. 
so he goes into this negative spiral that there is no point in working anymore there is no point in searching anymore because all i have failed everything is lost then he rouses himself out of this negative spiral by saying that no i should persevere there is a very beautiful quote in ramayana which says that anirvedah shriyo mulyam anirvedah param sukham it says that perseverance is the root of good fortune it is the primary virtue it is the cause of happiness and i want you to remember that persevere all of these phantom fears should not hold you back the psychological fears can impact your cat journey and you should prevent yourself from going into this negative spiral so get out of that particular fear and continue working hard so get out of these psychological fears and persevere keep working hard in the last one month to cat i don't want you to spend a lot of time worrying about things that have no impact on your score so what should you be doing instead so firstly i would recommend taking a look at krakus revision videos so we have put up revision videos for all parts of quant arithmetic algebra geometry modern maths every single thing the second part is that we have put up top 100 quality questions for the quant section we have already put this video up and in the next few days we'll be releasing the top 25 dilr sets on our youtube channel so please do take a look at the revision videos take a look at the top 100 questions and the top 25 dilr sets you should be working hard in the last few days make sure that you make every single second count anxiety should not stop you you are stronger than anxiety i know that all of krakus students will do really really well in cat so go ahead and persevere